I want all of your pizza. I would have just given you a piece. Oh, uh, man fell on the ground. internet, Corinne here, and today I'm making a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle costume for the ladies. Let's get started, shall we? First off, I dyed white tights, white gloves, and a white turtleneck dress. <laughs> turtleneck with Kelly Green Rit Dye. The synthetics came out darker than the cotton dress, more of an emerald than a Kelly Green, I would say, but I learned on Rit's website that Kelly Green and Aquamarine make emerald. So I dyed the dress again in aquamarine dye, and bam, great success. I put the dress over a trash bag on my body form and drew a straight line down the middle with Taylor's chalk. Next, I drew some curves around the boobs. Then I drew two more sets of curves under that first set and filled in that space with a sponge brush and white fabric paint. It was at this point Rob observed that the shape looked uh, very phallic looking. Gladly, there's a belt component to this costume. I proceeded to paint it the ahem shape with orange-yellow multi-surface paint and then outlined it with a sharpie. I absolutely love the cartoony vibe it has. Penis. Next, I created a kick-ass turtle shell that has the same number of pieces as a real effing turtle. Craft achievement unlocked! I created a template and used this template to trace and cut pieces out of an old cardboard box. Then I glued all of the cardboard pieces together with my glue gun. Burning yourself is inevitable. Don't be a little bitch about it. Then I traced the outline onto another piece of cardboard, set that aside, and glued the shell down to yet another piece of cardboard. I drew and cut an outer circle around the shell and expanded a lay circle on the other piece like so. Then I glued all 27 little tiny pieces to the shell. It took no time at all. Next, I cut out a circular piece from the middle of the flat side. This is gonna help it rest more naturally on your back. I used a long piece of elastic, folded it in half, ends connected like so with the safety pin, then glued to this area and reinforced with another piece of cardboard. Lastly, I spray painted it with hunter green paint. For my nunchucks, I used pipe insulation, plastic chain link, and electrical tape. Then I wrapped the handles with brown fabric I used from an old jacket sleeve. This came from a jacket that no one should ever wear. To finish off the look, I used Ben Nye cream paint across my eyes, a green wig, a brown belt, and a pair of brown boots. A big thanks to Elizabeth for suggesting this costume. And if you learned something today, why don't you go ahead and hit that like button, or just hit it because you like us. And as always, leave a comment below telling us what you would like to see us make on the show. Till next time. Thank you so much for watching. So many people have commented saying they like the t-shirts I've been wearing. I'm gonna give away some t-shirts. Details for how to get them in the description of this episode.